hello good morning or good whatever time it is i got my positive covid test results back yesterday i've been meaning to do another like what i cooked in a week vlog type video for a while but like with moving and everything it just i needed to get settled in and now like of course i have covid and it feels like settling is in is on pause anyways i thought that my next youtube video will be things that I cooked when I had COVID. stinking cute i put scallions on it but if you know me you know i hate scallions and it would just be for decor and well we're not doing that right now because my sister's not here to eat the scallions quite pickly in a good way this is called wu song tang in shanghainese we have beef tomato tomato paste carrots potatoes cabbage an onion and I kind of feel like it would be really good with like a little pasta you know so let's see if we have a little pasta oh look what do we have here baby macaroni they're not macaroni they're called elbows Gorgeous, gorgeous scrolls. Don't use pot holders. We use our sleeves instead, and then we get our sleeves really dirty. Mm -hmm. Pasta was a good call. I really can't get over how happy it makes me just looking at this carton of eggs in the morning. The yolks are also so orange, like the Pete and Jerry ones are. It smells really good. Based on the smell, I have good hopes for the taste. And we're going to have leftovers for sure. Everything's purple. Mmm. so okay, yummy. So, for some reason, I can't really explain. I really want a quiche. I was thinking about this last night. And I think I can Frankenstein together a quiche based on what I have. We've got some kale. I'm gonna try putting in shimeji mushrooms because this is what I have. Three quarters of an onion. Mexican style cheese. I don't have milk, but I have oat leaf. We need butter, 
think I'll use like my Galette crust. Seems similar. And as far as like a dish to bake it in, I have this. to me. It's okay. Room for improvement. It just gives us opportunities to grow. And remember things next time. Mmm. Smells good. I think she looks cute. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys. Words cannot describe on this this is pretty good for just like brain power it is dinner time pop of this tofu came out really crispy it's not cute, but it's crispy. Oh my god, this tofu. Mmm. Mmm. We need more sauce, but I like that everything has a slightly different flavor profile and it all adds together. Good morning. Well, I feel like I've been up forever because I have been up forever. I realize that it's time for me to use up like all of the things that I've been cooking and storing as leftovers because I have so many. And I'm thinking, okay, well not that, not that. Uh, so we have some cabbage with garlic that we saw take yesterday. We still have a ton of tofu puffs. I have some spinach. My fridge is basically leftover zone. for dinner because dinner I'm going to use salted mustard greens and make rice cakes but maybe do a vegetarian version because I don't really feel like eating meat right now tomorrow I'll be like I'll only have eggs and potatoes and tomatoes woken up from my nap I don't know if I'm that hungry like I'm snacky more than I am hungry and I was like sitting in my half awake state trying to remember what else I had in the fridge I think they're just falling down my freezer. Okay, I really should eat my pizza then. It's fine. You know I am having a conundrum and it's not supposed to be this hard. Ooh, my avocado. Well, the quiche came down down. Oh yeah, she's sad. I have part of an avocado. Maybe I'll have some edamame with it. She's pretty cute. Question for you guys. When you eat avocado toast, assuming you do eat avocado toast, do you use a fork and knife or do you use your hands? Mmm. A nice and garlicky bite. Dang it. I wish I had another avocado. That mommy's so good. 
I'm sitting here and I just got a text of my COVID results are ready. Are ready. <sighs> yep, still positive. Gonna marinate shiitake, salted mustard greens, edamame, bamboo shoots, rice cakes, and shiitake water. Okay, so I have a plate over there that I need to shoot, but I'm hungry. And so I saved myself a few pieces to stack on before I shoot. So you know I have energy, I'm gonna close this, and motivation, and I'm not just like, oh my God, let me eat, which happens a lot. Wow, the shiitake is really good. continue watching Singles and Burnout. I'm on episode two and I already feel really invested in the show. I discovered I really just like having pickled radishes and daikon on hand. One, this color is really pretty, but two, just adds like acidity and texture to every meal. <laughs> wow, I really did not think it was gonna be him. So for breakfast, I'm gonna make gyoza. The ones that I'm like mad about, my sister loves. And I'm gonna try it with an omelet skirt. Oh no, okay. I think this plate is too small. Will it come off? like this and your egg and your gyoza I'm gonna try to bastardize together tacos I defrosted some shrimp and I'm gonna brine it in some salt and baking soda I find that when you do that first before sauteing it it makes it like plumper and crisper versus less so it's like gonna be an Asian ish taco maybe <laughs> Good, the fat is good. Turn up the icon. Mmm. Really good with the daikon. Wow. I am thoroughly impressed. I'm still waiting my PCR results from yesterday, but according to this, I'm free. Not that I'm going anywhere anyways, but 